Hey everybody, great that you're back. In this video, I'm going to show you if you can use Filmora with the Toolbox Neo or Toolbox Elite. What you have to do, is it a good idea? Does it make video editing in Filmora easier? I show it all to you. So stay tuned and let's just dive into it. You can use Toolbox Neo or Elite very easy with Filmora. There are no videos out there that you can use it with Filmora. There are people saying, no, you can't use it, but you can use it. You just have to set your own presets. That's the whole thing. Toolbox doesn't have presets uploaded yet. You can customize all these buttons and wheels just as you like. It's a little work, but it's possible. So I can show you what I customized. I got this box two days ago, so I'm very new with this, but if I can manage it, everybody can manage it. I can show you how it works in combination with Filmora. So I can use the scroll wheel, I can use fast scrolling, or I can use frame by frame scrolling. If I select a clip, I can cut the clip, I can undo this, I can zoom in and zoom out the timeline, I can, by pressing this button, make it fit to the timeline, I can jump to the next clips here, I can increase or decrease my audio here, not the levels in the video, but for me, for monitoring, I can do this. I can understand. start playing, so I can start playing the video, replaying the video, I can uh, make the screen in full screen. What else can I do? Let me see. I can activate and deactivate a clip. Um, if I have a gap, I program this button so that I, I can select another video and I can move these clips. I can select all clips. I can separate the audio from one clip, or if I selected all clips, I can separate it from all clips. So I can copy and paste. Yes, I can close gaps. I can separate audio. Oh yeah, I can, I can create combination clips. I don't, I don't have them memorized yet. So that's a good thing that you can <laughs> have a cheat sheet here on the side to, to check this stuff combination clip is this one. So I can combine, I can very easily, um, you know, create a combination clip. I can jump to the first position or to the end of the video, move a clip up or down. Yeah, I can, I can do a screenshot. So if I'm in the video, I can say, okay, I want to, I want a picture of this so I can make a screenshot. So basically Every single shortcut you have in here, you can assign to a button or a button combination or a wheel. So you can just decide what would you like, what is important for your workflow, and you can just customize this. For this, you just have to download the toolbox console. And then, for example, if I tap on my scroll wheel, it is selected here, and then I can simply enter the commands here and give give it a name and then i have it in my in my workflow so it's as easy as that you could also create two menus for the for the volume i created a tour menu you can create macros there are so many options with this box and the good thing is like if I would open my Lightroom software now, then, then it will automatically switch. It will automatically assign me here. It automatically switches to the Lightroom settings. And so it is very easy to use this book. It is so, uh, this box, it is so, yeah, versatile. You can do so many things with this and it is so easy. It is so great to, to find certain parts i can really really zoom in and then i can simply go frame by frame to find the right position and so it is possible to do the whole thing with filmora it's just a little bit more work but you can do it and yeah hope this little video helped you and encouraged you to order it right now it is on sale you get 20 percent reduction and it is a very good value it is very nice build and the great thing is that all the buttons are different 
And so you don't have to look at it. You just feel it. So this is really an awesome idea. Instead of having a, a loop deck where all the, the buttons are uniformed, and even if you can assign different things to these regular loop deck buttons, you very often still have to look at it because it's not so intuitive as this one here because all the buttons have a different size. And this is very convenient for me. So, all right. Let me know in the comments what you think and give me a thumbs up. And thanks for watching. I see you next time.